Welcome to our podcast, where we cover unique and interesting stories for you. In this episode, we will discuss India's third rocket launch pad at Sri Harikota. The Indian Union Cabinet, chaired by Prime Minister Narendra Modi, approved the establishment of the third launch pad at ISRO's spaceport, Satish Dhawan Space Centre in Sri Harikota, Andhra Pradesh. The Indian government envisages the construction of the TLP and related facilities at a cost of Rs 39.85 crore within a span of four years. At present, the Indian spaceport at Sri Harikota is equipped with two launch pads. The first launch pad is meant for smaller rockets such as the PSLV and SSLV and the GSLV MK2, while the second launch pad is capable of launching all rockets right from the smallest SSLV to the largest LVM3. However, the first launch pad has served for more than 30 years, whereas the second launch pad has served for more than 20 years. The third launch pad project is meant to enable the launch of next-generation launch vehicles of ISRO and also to support as a standby launch pad for the second launch pad at Sri Harikota. This will also enhance the launch capacity for future Indian human spaceflight missions. The TLP will support the more capable semi-cryogenic engine variant of the LVM-3 rocket and also the scaled-up version of India's proposed NGLV rocket. The new launch pad will be built with maximum industry participation, fully utilizing ISRO's experience in establishing the earlier launch pads and maximally sharing the existing launch complex facilities. The TLP project will boost the Indian space ecosystem by enabling higher launch frequencies and the national capacity to undertake human spaceflight and space exploration missions, such as regular missions to the proposed Indian space station and manned missions to the moon. Thanks for tuning in. If you enjoyed this episode, be sure to subscribe and share your thoughts in the comments. Stay connected for more exciting discussions and updates in our next podcast.